Multiple floor roof. Add roof edges. This lesson describes how to add roof sections to multiple story roofs. A look at the 3D model and the multiple floor roof upper drawing illustrates the complexity of this roof design. Switch into Roof Mode and enable the Multiple Floor Roof feature to display the bearing walls from both floors on the roof plan. Note the multiple roof sections that will be required to design the full roof. Next, open the Roof Options menu and set the default pitch to 10 inches. Select OK to return to the roof plan. Select Draw, Auto Roof. Select Yes in the prompt that appears to include the walls from the multi-floor roof. A look at the 3D model shows that the roof is incorrect. Other roof design tools will be needed to complete the complex design. Return to the upper floor roof plan and remove the current roof. Select Draw, Auto Roof again. When prompted, select No to add the roof to the upper floor only. Open a new vertical tab to view the roof plan and 3D model side by side. For the lower floor room at the back of the plan, use the Adjust Item command to move the reference point on the roof edge of the upper floor to the rear wall on the lower floor. The roof above the garage needs to extend to the left wall of the lower floor in the same way. Use the Adjust command to reference the roof edge to the lower floor wall. The Fit to Roof tool can now be used to fit the remaining lower floor walls to the roof. To do this, edit the lower floor wall of the main house, select the Top of Wall tab, and click the Fit to Roof button. Repeat this process to fit the garage wall to the roof. To add a roof to the lower floor area on the right side of the house, Select the Trace Roof command and then trace a roof around the uncovered area excluding the built-out bay. Note that the reference circle is positioned along the center of the roof edge, which happens to be an area that has no wall on account of the built-out bay. A look at the 3D model shows how the roof appears when this occurs. Use the Adjust command to move the reference point to a location along the vertical wall. Next, select the Add Roof command and click the five walls of the bay. Right-click to add the roof. Review the appearance of the roofs in 3D. At this stage, roof sections can be added to complete the garage roof. Commands such as Trace Roof are useful for adding separate roof sections. If Trace Roof is used to add the roof over the garage, the overhang of the added roof will overlap the main roof. This overlap will create inaccuracies in the materials list and 3D model. The Add Roof Edges command is used to add roof edges that are a continuation of an existing roof. By using this tool, the roof can be modified as one component. Select Draw, Add Roof Edges. First, click the existing roof that the new roof edges will be added to. The roof becomes highlighted. Next, trace the perimeter of the area to receive the roof edges. Once the roof edges have been traced, right-click the roof and select Regenerate. Orbit the model to review the roof design. 